everyone, um, yeah, I am really sleepy right now, and I know I should take a nap right now, but I need to get some recording done because I have been slacking off a little bit, and that is not good. Anyways, um, this episode is also kind of boring because I'm only focusing on one request, and I think I would, and during this episode, I think I got I think I am going to, like, die with it. So, I take a bath. And we finally get introduced to the bathhouse. And for one, for once, I'm not cheap and actually pay for a bath. Although, I found out in, apparently in Rune Factory, um, Tides of Destiny. Morning! Um, there, you can take baths for free. So, I, and then, I have watched a little bit of gameplay about, on it, and it seems like a really amazing game, and I know I should really get it, because, I, but I don't know if I would make an LP, since I don't want to deal with, like, console games and, and stuff, it might be a little hard to record them, because, like, capture cards, they cost a lot of money, like, good ones, and then I am always after quality, um, so... But I probably will get the game at some point. Huh. Ah, failure. Huh. Huh. Oh yeah, I might actually purposely show you like the death scene. I don't know, I can't remember if there's like an actual like little scene thing. I don't know, I haven't played this game in a while. I might act intentionally show it. Because I I am I just don't like to die and stuff. In um in usually in games, so I always stop with one potion and so health potions, whatever. Right now, we don't have a lot of money, so I can't ah. do that. So, for today, I'm just going to take a bath and kill a lot of time. But I do visit everyone, which is nice. Because I don't really do that a lot. I am way too used to Room Factory 3. Because, um, in Room Factory 3, um, things regenerate in the field as the day goes by, but apparently it doesn't in Room Factory 2. I don't know why I compare those two games together a lot. It's probably because, um, because Room Factory 1, I consider it to be, um, on its own kind of, um, game, and then Rune Factory 2 and 3 are more similar, because, um, because in Rune Factory 1 there's, um, like, seven dungeons, and then, um, it takes, lo it takes longer to, um, play Rune Factory 1, while, um, Rune Factory 2 and 3, it's a game, even though you have to go through, like, two generations in Rune Factory 2, and, um, yeah, like, um, it took me, like, in my first run of Rune Factory 2, like, I had no idea what I was doing. So I moved on to this second generation, um, year 2, because I didn't know about the rival marriages. And, um, in Rune Factory 3, I knew somewhat of what I was doing because I played in Japanese, and I finished the Jap- I didn't finish the Japanese one. Um, I got close though, like, I beat the, um, water winter dungeon guy, and then I had no clue what I was doing afterwards. And then, um, in my English version of Rune Factory 3, um, I beat the game 
third year, second year, I don't know. It's probably around there, but yeah. Oh yeah, do you guys think that I should cut out, like, um, killing time, just, like, standing there? Should I cut those parts out? Because those... Good yes, afternoon. I'd rather, um, get footage of actual stuff, because... I don't know, because, like... Like, should I cut out... Should I cut out the, Good um, afternoon. just waiting... Things? Just waiting, and then, um, waiting for time to pass and stuff. Should I cut those parts off because I don't know. Hello. Good afternoon. Chopsticks, seriously. Your family's quite boring to talk about someone trying to eat from chopsticks. I mean chopsticks aren't really that hard to eat, but But it irritates me to Good use afternoon. chopsticks while eating rice. Don't ever do that. Good afternoon! Good afternoon! Hey, it's Ray. I swear he's British. Good afternoon. Hi. Howdy, kiddo. Hi there. Hi there. Why does everyone talk about food in this game? Seriously. I mean, I can understand with, um, with Herman and, like, the rich people because they always talk about food. Especially in Room Factory 3, the rich people, they're actually kind of entertaining. Good day, love. Like they talk backwards or something. No, they talk in opposite, sorry. Hey there! And then they always talk about food, too. And then there's Colette, who always talks about food and her high metabolism. So she doesn't gain any weight, and everyone just talks about food here, which is actually kind of boring. But yeah, I mean, aren't there ad aren't there like better things to talk about other than food? I mean, food is good, but still. Okay, that was a false yawn. Sorry. I hate it when, like, um, you're- it feels like you're about to sneeze, but then you don't sneeze. I hate that. I get that with yawning, too. It's annoying. Come on in. There's nothing like a nice hot bath to see oh, the body and I spirit. love this scene. It's hilarious. Hey, is Cammy hiding in here? It's still burning. No, I ears. haven't seen her. Are you two playing hide and seek again? To marry him in generation <laughs> two. You sure? Hmm. I'd better um, take a look myself. Wait, I probably said this before, but I'm going to marry Mana in generation one, and then um. Hey. I'm going to Roy, show stop right um, there. the you marriages can't go into the women's of bath. Lionel and Orlin. That's hmm. it. 
Next time, I'll have to tell her that the bathhouse is um, off limits. Marrying twins at the same time it kind of creeps me out. And Roy, he's just annoying. Hi. Afternoon. Let's try to go to the women's bath. Aww. Falcion. I think I'm going to end the video here, so see ya.